Penguins pregame is brought to you by Edgar Snyder and Associates, a law firm helping injured people. Call now for a free legal consultation. And by Heffern Tillotson. For financial security, everyone should have a master plan. In the Penguins game against Detroit last season on March 27th, Casey DeSmith took a photo with a young Penguins fan named Bryson Finacey. Bryson held up a sign that said, I officially beat cancer. Do any players want a picture by the boards to help me celebrate? Let's go Pens, Bryson Strong. Last Tuesday, Bryson and DeSmith met face-to-face -face in the Penguins locker room when Bryson participated in the So Many Angels photo shoot. I remember them as, as soon as I saw them. That's always a special thing, uh, you know, when anyone beats cancer, but especially, you know, a little kid who has his whole life ahead of him. So, um, Obviously, just seeing that sign, you know, I'm going to stop and take a photo, and I know uh, Boiler did as well, um, being a cancer survivor himself. Um, my sister beat cancer when she was little, uh, so it just means a little extra to me. For Casey DeSmith and the rest of the Penguins, Hockey Fights Cancer is far more than just a slogan. For more on some of the things the Penguins do, we're joined now, great story here by Dan Potash. Danny? Well, Rob, this T-shirt and what it says is just a perfect example of why Pittsburgh is stronger than cancer. Last week of practice, of course, we saw a lot of slap shots on the ice. The Penguins usually do that during practice. But we also saw a lot of snapshots on the ice for some very special kids. It was a picture-perfect day. Last week, the Penguins and the Penguins Foundation welcomed four special guests to the UPMC Lemieux Sports Complex, Max, Lowen, Nora, and Bryson for a photo shoot with So Many Angels, a nonprofit organization that takes photos of children with cancer and transforms them into whatever or whoever they want to be when they grow up. These families have seen what we've done for other kids, but what they see is their kid photographed against the green screen. They really don't know what they're going to get. They probably have an idea, but it's usually nothing like what our artists come up with. So Many Angels was connected to the Penguins Foundation thanks in large part to a chance encounter with Jeff Carter and his family at a local farmer's market, helping spawn a Penguins hockey-themed photo shoot. These are some pretty amazing kids, and to see what they go through and to hear their stories, and it's challenging, and it was an incredible day just seeing them be able to be kids and have fun and show their personalities. It's so fantastic for the opportunity for our patients to participate in something like this. Um, the photo shoot really provides a morale boost and lifts spirits at, at such an important time uh, for these kids. When you partner up with other organizations and you see the kids having different jerseys and, and it's just, it's amazing because I'm used to doing these photo sessions with one or two assistants or Josh, our, our lead photographer and lead editor, uh, it, he'll be here and I'll try to talk to the parents, but to have all these people, you know, we've got equipment people here, costume people here, jerseys, we're swapping out jerseys, and just to see the look on these kids' faces and the families' faces during this, it's, it just feeds me and makes me want to do more of this. The children will receive a 16 by 24 inch canvas print to keep, but they receive so much more on this day. The children and their families had VIP seating for Penguins practice and afterward had the chance to get up close and personal with their favorite team in the locker room. A one of a kind experience. We would never have this sort of opportunity, you know, if, if the foundation didn't reach out and it was just, magical. The kids, you know, have never been that close to the ice and have never been that close to players before and it was just amazing watching them light up. Once they kind of told us about some of the extra things that they were going to be able to do um, and whatnot, it was it was very exciting for us to see him, uh, his reactions. He actually got shy when he was meeting some of the players and stuff. Um, but to see the practice and the photo shoot, um, it was more than we could have asked for. All the players were just so willing to say hi and sign an autograph and take a picture and know, you know everyone was so kind. I think being that close to the players you can tell he shut down a little bit. I think he didn't know exactly what to do um, but even since we've came in and sat down and he's kind of away from them a little bit um, I think we've already heard him say about five or six times that this is the best day ever. It's the best day of his life. And tonight Max, Lowen, Nora, Bryson and their families are guests of the Penguins and the Penguins Foundation in Sidney Crosby's charity suite where they all received 
their special canvas from the photo shoot, and each one was autographed by Sidney Crosby. So Many Angels recently received a grant from the Pittsburgh Penguins Foundation, and since it was founded in 2017, So Many Angels has done these special photo shoots for over 160 kids that are battling cancer. Simply a great story, and once again, a great T-shirt that you can purchase at marylemieux.org. All proceeds benefiting the Mary Lemieux Foundation.